Hey guys, welcome back to our channel and today I've got another cool tutorial for you which is called the Luma Fade Transition. The Luma Fade Transition is a very often used technique for travel videos. So we need two clips for this transition. I've already dragged and dropped my two clips into my timeline. Uh, those are two drone shots. The first one is from a landscape and the second one is from some flying birds. So first of all we need to know where we want to start our transition. So I cut my second clip exactly to the point where I want to have this transition started. And what we need to do is we're gonna drag the clip below our first clip. Then we're gonna go to video effects, search for gradient wipe. And we're gonna drag and drop this effect onto our top clip. Go to effect controls, scroll down to gradient wipe. And then we scroll to the point where we wanna let this transition start. We're gonna select this little stopwatch icon to create this transition and it will automatically create a keyframe at 0%. And then we go to the very end of the clip to the point where we wanna let this transition end and we drag it up to 100%. And what you can see here is that the clip fades out into the next clip. So, but there's a few other things to know and the transition will fade into the highlights first. But our birds are very black, so what we're gonna do is we're gonna select Invert Gradient. Then it will fade into the blacks first. So for this clip it looks that will look a little bit better. Um, you have to play with the settings, depends on your clip you're gonna have. And I would also recommend dragging the softness up, probably something between 70 and 100. Okay, yeah, that's pretty much it. Uh, we can also play with the speed, so we can move this clip a little bit to the left and also moving the transition a little bit. The transition is a little bit longer. Yeah, that looks way better in my opinion. For example, you can also create the opposite transition. So you will not start at 0% and go to 100%. You're gonna do exactly the opposite, starting at 100% and going down to 0%. Of course, you can play with the settings, with the speed, with the softness. It depends on your clips and what you exactly wanna do. But that's pretty much it for this tutorial, I hope you enjoyed the video, if you did please leave me a like and a comment, don't forget to subscribe and see you in the next video, peace out.